Good morning, everybody. It's Lynn from A Bit of Birdsong. I wanted to catch up on the last couple of days, maybe three days of journaling. I have worked a couple of days and I'm actually going to cover for someone today. So this will, I'll make this as quickly, do this as quickly as I can. I know you remember this spread, or if you watched it, you would probably remember. Um, about the European goldfinch. And that was the 18th and the 19th. And because I was running out of space, or because I am running out of space in the journal, I decided to um, do just a small flip page here. And it can go to either side. Like, I don't really think it takes away from this spread. I love the continuation of blue and on my work days, I do not put pressure on myself to try to do some elaborate um, scrapbooking or journaling or anything like that. But accomplished so much today. And I have on here the first day of winter, although it might have been the following day. Um, at any rate, I, I was thinking that the 20th was the first day. I, it may be. It might have been the 21st. Anyway, that, that could be wrong for the ages, but... <laughs> It's there. I just put a little tag on. And then for um, for the last couple of days, let me put this block under here to lift this page a little bit. This was really a fun page to do, both of these pages. Um, I've just been experimenting with some different things. And again, this page is very low key. It's not um, super ornate because I didn't have a lot of time. and. I continued on with the blue and a lot of gesso on these pages. Uh, this one, I put some gesso on the page and then did some stamping, actually with the block that's under the book. And I just took a page from a vintage uh, encyclopedia and tore out this image of the birds and glued that in. And I think that's really pretty. I wanted this to have some black in it. On this page, um, I had this layer of gesso down and I decided to take a watercolor pencil. You can see where I was holding it, it's covered in gesso. I decided to take a watercolor pencil and sketch into that while it was still damp. Um, I thought maybe the moisture from the gesso would just, you know, melt down that, that lead and the pencil like it does when you put water on it. And it was so smooth, it really did. That was a, a really neat thing to do. So I just sketched this little, little girl and made a few notes to keep up with what's going on so that I can look back. I have lovely day, Friday worked, and I've got the 21st, Saturday worked, the 22nd. And then we were invited to a little birthday dinner last night, so I just made a note of that. So this is the whole page. I did put a little bit of lace. I have a beautiful clip that um, Alejandrina sent to me. And I may put something on that. I haven't done it yet. And with all of these pages, as I go back and look at the pages and enjoy the journal, um, I may, you know, add a few touches here and there. But that's where I am, and I cannot believe that today is the 23rd. So I guess... I'll be on to another page tonight and tomorrow. And thank you so much for watching. I will see you soon. Bye.